I'm Vanessa and today we're here at Sukjun Kim's Taekwondo School where we're going to take a look at these guys do their tests and they're going to advance in different belts and later on we're going to have a talk with Master Kim who is the head of Taekwondo School who is an 8th degree black belt and he's the one who teaches these kitties back here what they're doing. So sit back, take a look and learn something. I'm here with Master Kim. He's the head of the Taekwondo school here. And we're gonna ask him a few little questions. So Master Kim, thank you for talking with us. You're welcome. So tell me, how long have you been practicing Taekwondo for? This is 37 years. 37 years? Yes. And you're an eighth degree black belt? Yes. Which means what for everybody who's out there? Well, our ranking system goes up to ninth. To ninth. And how have you been doing this rigorous training every single day or? Oh, no, no. We just begin when I was a child and then it keeps on practicing and practicing. Mm -hmm. And this way I end up. <laughs> what are the difference between the belts? Like what do you mean? Like the degrees. First you have white and then after Yellow, that. white, yellow, green, blue, red. And after how many so much can you improve? Do you have to say I know you have to take certain tests like the people here to do? Every every yeah, every every ranking test we expect the students to do about thirty lessons. About thirty lessons? That's a lot of work. What do you want them to achieve, your students? What's like here, you know, when you they see them have working? To, they have to improve their mind mm -hmm. and body. Yeah, it's all a lot of based on discipline, right? Of course. Pretty much. Stop disciplining. How do you, like, somebody who just comes in, who's new, how do you get them started and not to give up? Well, we use those bars. Uh -huh. <laughs> we make them hold the bars. Mm -hmm. We make them do uh, sit-ups, push-ups, front kicks, turning kicks, mm -hmm. stationary exercises, punches, mm -hmm. and so on. And tell me, what's the difference between, okay, this is Taekwondo, what's mm -hmm. the difference between karate, tai chi, jiu-jitsu, all the other forms of martial arts? Well, you know, we are born with two legs and two arms, so I cannot really say there are so much great differences, however. Mm -hmm. Taekwondo is Korean version of unarmed martial art. Mm -hmm. Karate is a Japanese version of unarmed martial art. Mm -hmm. Kung Fu means studying, that's Chinese version of uh, uh, martial arts. Now we all have something in common because we, it's a defensive and offensive, mm -hmm. and then we kick and we punch and so on. Mm -hmm. Now obviously we, the Taekwondo is a little more systemized today because this is a little more of a, a new world out of self-defense mm -hmm. than Chinese or the Japanese. Mm -hmm. We all have a certain influences one another. The Taekwondo world does not begin until 1955. So Ricardo, tell me first of all, how old are you? Ten years old. Really? And what is this Kickstart program? Well, this Kickstart program is uh, about um, kicking and punching, um, trying to do combinations, um, skipping kicks, jumping kicks, and we also try to do hapkido, uh, self-defense, and all those things. And how long have you been doing this for? For three years. Did you want to do it yourself, or did your parents like want you to do it? No, I, I actually told my parents that I would like to join to take. And you're going to continue this until you're older or you're going to stop eventually? No, I'm probably going to do it until I'm older. And what belt are you right now? I'm a red belt with three stripes. Which means actually what for everybody who's watching? Well, that means that I have um, three black stripes, so then uh, on my next test I would be a black belt. On your next test you would be a black belt? Right. 
And today's your test, right? Right. And how long are these tests for? Well, sometimes they're about 15 or 20 minutes, sometimes longer. Mm -hmm. And what routines do you actually have to do? Is it uh, something you have to practice uh, for no, a long it's time? It's kind of like a normal class. We have to do punching, uh, kicking, and we have to break boards, patterns. All right, well, thank you very much, and good luck on the test. That's it. I'm here with one of Master Kim's students. So tell us, what's your name? Amy Bryson. And how long have you been practicing Taekwondo? Um, about two months. Two months, so you're a white belt at this moment? I am a white belt. And you have a test today? I do have a test today. Okay, and if you pass the test, what's, what's the next level? A yellow belt. Yellow belt? Yes. How long does, how long does your test last? Um, from what everyone tells me, it's like, it, it goes by really quick. It's only like 15 minutes long. Mm -hmm. Are you very nervous? I'm extremely nervous, yes. What, is, what does Taekwondo do for you? I mean, does it? It's a great sense of discipline. Um, it, it gives me a lot of confidence. Um, it's a great workout. It puts you in a great frame of mind. Yeah. I, I like the fact that it's so disciplined. Yeah. And I think that, I know that for me, that's what I really needed, because I, I... You need some discipline. <laughs> I do need some discipline. <laughs> and are you gonna continue doing this until you achieve like a black belt, or? Oh yes, definitely. oh yes, definitely. I really found my niche on this one. Yeah. Yeah. And do you practice every day, or? I go um, four times a week. And it's like rigorous training, or? It, it is, I, I mean, I've never done anything uh, this athletic since high school. Mm -hmm. so this is the first time I've ever like really put myself and, you know, just going over and over and over again. Mm -hmm. So that's why. I mean, for me, it's very rigorous training. Yes, but for some of these people, probably not. Yeah, I see a lot of them are. Everybody's different degrees here, so it depends. Yeah. Well, thank you very much. Thank you very much. And good luck. Hey, we're here with Greg. He's one of Master Kim's students. So, tell me, you getting ready for your test? Well, actually, I'm not testing today. I'm just here to help Master Kim out with the test. Okay. So if we can see, he's a black belt already. And how long has it taken you to do this? Um, I got my black belt in April 1986 after about eight and a half years of training. Wow. Are you any certain degree right now? Or? Well, right now I'm first degree. Which first is, degree? Yeah. And are you like going to keep on going? I mean, actually, what's the highest degree you could go for? In Taekwondo, we have nine, nine degrees, but it usually takes a while. You're pretty old by then. Yeah? yeah. It's a lot of rigorous training and work? Yeah, it's a lot of discipline. Yeah. How, how, like, how long do you do this every day or one, how, how much a week? Uh, generally, I do it about four to five times a week when I can. And you're going to continue doing this until you hit ninth degree, or what do you plan to achieve? Well, I just plan to keep training as long as my body and health will allow me to do it. So, that could be when I'm 40, could be when I'm 80. You know, exactly. So. True. Well, thank you. Thank you. And I'll see you guys.
Okay. All right, hi, I'm back, and I just want to show you the board. This is what they're going to break during their tests. You can see it's really hard, very thick, and it takes a lot of work and a lot of practice to break these suckers. Because you can see, it's very hard. You can't really break it. I guess you really got to concentrate and know what you're doing to do it. So if you keep on watching, you'll see these guys break some of these. Ricardo, you're supposed to hit him. Ready? Yeah! Ricardo, you gotta punch too. Back kicks too. Catch it, 
Bro, come here, Jimmy. A little more closer, closer, closer. Move on, move on. Punch! No good? Not good. You don't think you can with the punch?
that's the end of the program. Hope you enjoyed what you saw. These guys went through a lot of work to do their tests. Some of them got their belts, some of them didn't. And the talk with Master Kim, I hope that was useful for you guys who are interested in Taekwondo. I'm interested. I hope you guys are. And uh, if you want to do something good, this is something to do. It's good exercise. But that's about it. I'll see you guys next time.